Hi, my name is Quincy Bees and I want to be a male exotic dancer. That's how I'm gonna start this. <laughs> hey, YouTube! <laughs> hey, YouTube. Should I look at this or look at this? Look at this. Uh, cool. <laughs> Hey YouTube, welcome back to Naturally Philo. This is my friend Quincy Beast. Let's go, let's go. Oh my gosh. I urge the pose, you gonna put it right there. Somewhere. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so a lot of y'all were asking, how do I do his finger coils? Many people DM him, so I was like, you know what, we need to film this video. Right. So this is a part of my Men and Moisture series. So you'll be seeing many guys coming here and we're gonna be slaying their Slay. hair. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so let's begin. This is the before. So his hair is growing, guys, yes. and this is in the afro right now. And we're gonna give him some really nice finger coils. That's his signature look. And before we get started, remember to purchase your Keep It Naturally visors. K I N. <laughs> Ken. <laughs> Naturallyphilo.com. All right, cool. uh, let's do this. What, what is it? I'm just oh, showing it to the camera. <laughs> this nigga, Philo is really tough, bro. <laughs> All right, so before I wash his hair, I like to massage his scalp with my two oil mix. I allow that to sit for about five to 10 minutes, then I shampoo his hair with Shea Moisture's Raw Shea Butter Shampoo. Next, I use ORS's Hair Mayonnaise, an excellent deep treatment to deep condition his hair. All right, so a little bit about Quasi's hair. He has low porosity, thick, really dense hair, and he's also in the type 4C range. I've been doing his hair since February, so all the products in this video work well on his hair. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> So after applying the deep treatment and combing his hair out for all the tangles, I'm going to put this bag on his head and I'm going to leave it on for about 15 to 20 minutes just so the deep treatment can be in full effect. What? You said look left, look right. <laughs> Deep treatment washed out, moving on to moisturizing his hair. Fresh step, kinky curly, not today, leave-in. Then I follow that up with my two oil mix, Jamaican black castor oil with vitamin E oil. So we all know black castor oil doesn't have the most pleasant scent. So I wanted to see Quasi's reaction. Oh, that shit stinks. That shit does stink. Oh my god. Oh! It's like, it's like, it's like, um, the manure. <laughs> LOL. So, I appreciate how natural it is, and it gets the job done, so why not? <laughs> Last step in the lock method is cream. So here I'm using my shea butter mix, and I'm done moisturizing his hair. Alright y'all, so here I'm just sectioning out the part I'll be working with first. I've been doing this hairstyle for this guy for so long, so the products I'm about to show you work the best and get the job done. So I begin with Lotta Body's Foaming Mousse, and I put that all throughout his hair. Um, once again, I do not use too much of each product, just a little bit, and it works wonders. Second, I'm using Curls' Blueberry Jelly. And again, just using a little bit of that. To twist each coil individually, I use Kinky Curly's Curling Custard. Who knows that song? Let me know in the comment section if you know it. So I take some of the custard and I put it on the back of my hand, then I take small sections so he doesn't like it too big because we don't separate it at the end. So if you separate your hair then you can make this as big as you want, but I make the coils extremely small because we don't separate when it's all dry. To begin, I part out a small section, I split it in two, then I twist it once at the root, and then I begin twirling this section on my fingers, and that's how I create the coil. I'll keep demonstrating this, but you want to make sure the root is secure before you continue twirling the rest of the part. So here I'm just adding water onto the rest of his hair. Couldn't find my spray bottle, but that would have made it much easier. <laughs> Oh, you're 
recording? Mm -hmm. I'm over here sleeping. So. <laughs> so let's recap. These are the products I use to coil Chrissy's hair. I've tried many combinations of products in the past and they all just left white residue and flakes but this combination does not. Like trust me, we've been through this since February. His hair is thick and coarse so I wanted products that would define the coils while not leaving them hard or crunchy. And this worked well. Let's recap. You part out a section, put some of the custard through it, you divide it in two, twist once at the root, and then you begin twirling. So after the coil is dry, you want to coat it with a light oil such as argan oil. And to preserve this style, at night, Quissy sleeps in a satin bonnet. Alright Quissy, we just finished! Oh, I see how it looks. <laughs> yes! Whoa! It's shaking! It. It's shaking! It. It's shaking! Whoa! <laughs> ah, flawless! You flawless? Hey, it's shaking! <laughs> I don't really okay. care if you cry. On the real, you should have never lied. <laughs> All my friends are dead. <laughs> Naturally, feel it does it again. You see, of course, bees at Earth's opposed. Yeah, I'm fleek. Keep it naturally. <laughs> So I just finished. He's mad hype. He's about to host at the Vito concert. Yeah. Hey. Make sure y'all catch that recap on my IG page. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Alright, so thank you guys so much for watching. This is the Men and Moisture series. So every week we'll be inviting a new guy to come. We're gonna do we're gonna slay their hair. So alright, that's enough. That's Remember cool. to like, comment, comment and, and subscribe. subscribe. Have a blessed Last day. day. And until next time on Naturally Philo. Keep, keep it, it naturally. naturally. <laughs>